Howdy, I'm Lee Wilson, and this is TGO Wyoming. And today, got some really cool for you guys. Uh, we're going to take a look at the XDM 9 Compact 3.8. Good buddy Jim just picked this up today, and he's been generous enough to let us use it <clears throat> for a video demonstration. We also have his raced out XDM 9 for comparison. But, we don't have the box here today, but uh, I can tell you what comes in that anyway. <clears throat> it's essentially the same as what comes in a regular XDM box. But first things first, we're going to go ahead and make sure the gun is clear. Physical and visual inspection, nothing in it. Same thing with the other M. We're all good. Except for grease. That's why we have hoodies. Uh, good old catch-all for grease. <clears throat> Alright, so this is a new offering from Springfield Armory. The XDM9 Compact. This is a really cool setup. Uh, originally they came out with the XDM you know, 4.5, which original first incarnation just didn't even have the 4.5 on it, it was just the XDM. And uh, <clears throat> then they brought out the 3.8s, started tagging the XDMs with 4.5, and you had the 3.8s, which had essentially a full-size grip on them with a short slide and short barrel. Well, the newest offering from Springfield is really cool because it is the 3.8 slide combination with a short uh, frame, essentially. It's a great concealed carry piece with all the same features as an XDM. Very similar to an XD subcompact, just a little bit longer. <clears throat> so let's go over some of the main features of the gun. Um, you have a loaded chamber indicator right here, which is a very nice little feature on all the XDMs and the XDs. Your cocked indicator, again, double safeties. You have your grip safety and your trigger safety. And then the magazine release is ambidextrous, so it works either side, which is nice. Now, the big thing about the 3.8 is that with its short magazine, it still holds three or <laughs> 13 rounds of 9, which is phenomenal. I mean, that's very, very, very high for a you know, size of gun. The gun operates essentially exactly like an XDM. You still have a removable and interchangeable back strap. Uh, right now it has the smallest one on there. Very easy to operate controls. You can easily get to the slide release, take down levers, you know, right up there gives you a good indexing point for with your hands, depending on your hold. <clears throat> it does come with an accessory rail, or a little Picatinny rail on there, so you can throw a light on there. Essentially, from this point, like right in here, this is all the same XDM. Same, you know, contouring and texturing on the grips, which help reduce lateral and vertical torque on it, so that way you have better control over the gun. And same XDM sights, <clears throat> match grade barrel, which is phenomenal for a gun this size. Uh, can't wait to get out and, you know, actually put some rounds through this. So, you have to buy some 9 or bum from Jim. <laughs> but, uh, really cool little gun. Now, one of the nicest features about the XDM subcompact, or the compact, is that it does come with a 19 round magazine with a grip extension. Now, this essentially turns the gun into an, XD3, or an XDM 3.8. So you have a full-size gun, great concealed carry piece because if for some reason you're in an engagement where you run out of 13 rounds of ammo, drop it, slap in your 19 rounder, and go. And that gives you a whole lot of extra firepower, which is never a bad thing, especially for an extra kid, you know, carry mag. <clears throat> and this really is just a regular old XDM mag, 19 rounds. A great, well-designed little grip extension. Of course, as with all XDMs, you get a double mag carrier, a holster, and your two magazines, which is a good setup. And still, since it's an M, takedown is very simple, very safe. It does run a you know, dual-captured recoil spring and guide rod, which is kind of a nifty setup. Just brilliant design overall. The XDs are good guns. The XDMs are better guns. And they've all worked so very well. We're really excited about this. It's going to be a cool piece. For comparison purposes, we have Jim's XDM9, <clears throat> which this is his uh, his Ipsic gun, and it's really an impressive little piece. He had the small grip on there and actually sent it off to have a grip texture done, um, or grip reduction and texturing done, and put high-vis sights on it, match sights, one of which is a... Uh, is a bleh, Fiber optic sight. Thank you, Jim. <clears throat> and he also had a trigger job on it done, which has a basically a little trigger stop for over travel adjustment. It's a phenomenal little setup, but 
size comparison here, we have the XDM and the M, you know, 3.8 compact. And you can see there's a good chunk of space that's taken off of the 3.8. And on the M, basically, good half inch of barrels is gone. So for a concealed carry piece, this is really an awesome setup. Um, really looking forward to testing it. We'll have some testing video of it hopefully next week or so, depending on you know how the weather goes. But <clears throat> that's pretty much it. First look at the Springfield XDM 9 Compact. So we finally got some uh, range time to come out here and test the XDM 3.8 Compact. So got the, uh, the 13 round mini mag loaded, flush fit. We're going to do some accuracy testing now. We don't have a stapler right now, so we're just going to be shooting at a target we've already shot at. But I'll tell you beforehand, I'm shooting at the lower right-hand circle of this target. So, I'm not the greatest shot, but we'll see how this goes and what the foot recoil is like. Flinch. Yeah, serious flinch on that one. Yeah, oh well, it's cold today, my hands hurt. But uh, we'll run the camera down and see what the target looks like. All right, so forgive the wind, but uh, even with the flinch, majority of the shots are right in here. So uh, there's some 223 in there, but we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So definitely a good shooting gun. Um, Real easy to shoot, real nice handling. I, I like it quite a bit. I think you guys will be real impressed if you pick up an XDM 3.8 Compact. And until next time, stay safe and shoot straight.